by bid, the Kekem Kuku transformation plant is seeing the day one and a half years after the laying of the foundation stone by the Minister of the Economy, Planning and Regional Development, Louis Paul Motazi, closely monitored by Emmanuel Nusi, promoter of the new industries, work at the Kekem Ultra Modern Kuku transformation plant has advanced considerably and from every indication, work now stands at 40%. Simultaneously, structural engineers are presently working on the metallic frame with technical partners like Cometal. Worthy of note, those equipments were shipped into Cameroon from Côte d'Ivoire, manufactured by Ivoire Engineering. Denise O'Donnell is the chief project manager of the Kekem Koko transformation plant. Buller equipment should be installed. In parallel with the Buller equipment, there will be a lot of piping and electrical work. Uh, so soon after that Buller erection, we should be in a position to uh, uh, do a test process of the Buller equipment, which will last uh, normally a further two months at least. Uh, and over this six plus two months of testing by Bula, let's say eight months, uh, we'll be in parallel working with the utility supplies of water, gas, steam, air. So at that stage, during test of the Bula equipment, we expect to have the utility supplies for uh, operating of the Bula equipment to be available for them to do the final test. The evolution of the Kekem Koko transformation project was facilitated by the presence of other partners who are bent on seeing the project come to fruition. Can build is involved in the civil engineering part of the, 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 the project. The project. We are the first on the site to carry out excavation. Now when we come, we prepare everything for the workers since the villagers don't have lodging facilities. So we build camps for all the workers that we have. Après la, la pose de la première pierre en juin 2016, after the laying of the cornerstone, we had to move directly to the excavation, especially the three platforms. We have done a commendable job. We can assure you that the first semester of 2018, the factory will go operational. Du premier trimestre de l'année 2018, l'usine sera bel et bien fonctionnelle. À Kékem, nous avons eu la grâce de d'obtenir auprès du promoteur le, le traitement du mur de soutènement. We are involved in waterproofs and water tightness walls and we equally work on the floor. So we have one month to complete this job, then we'll move to the next stage. Un mois pour libérer la partie qui est sous le bâtiment. Instrumelec c'est une société spécialisée dans le domaine de l'électricité. Instrumelec specializes in electricity exclusively. We conceive and install electricity in the factory, buildings and around the factory site. So it is worth mentioning that giving such a challenging task to an established home-based company is a very demanding one. So we are involved in low and high voltage installations. The project is going to take three phases with equipment that will be supplied by Bulle. Les, tous les équipements industriels fournis par Buller. Dans le projet de Neo, nous avons été pré-sélectionnés. We were selected for the utility services like piping, like refrigeration. We are going to carry out with the gas piping and water treatment. In short, we are taking care of the heating and cooling systems. Pour euh, le transfert de faits différents fluides. The multi-billion francs project is extremely envious and appetizing. These already beckoning on international partners who are scrambling to pick up shares. We have been very pleased to be here uh, visiting the site and the construction of the Neo Industry uh, producing plant and it's absolutely amazing the work that has been done uh, until this point. Of. I think it's a, it's, a, it's a brilliant incentive for the region. I think it will create a, a lot of jobs and, and sort of needed jobs in, in, in West Africa in general. I think it's great for the general cocoa industry and for sort of exports and valid adu goods which which is very needed in, across West Africa. Um, West Africa is or, or Africa is, is uh, exports less value-added goods than any other continent and it's, it's very 
um, it's very good to see projects like this um, being funded by government and by various projects, uh, various partners um, uh, across Europe and, and locally. And it's very refreshing. A superb example of collaboration from different people that will add value to a product and advance the country as well as the business. Mr. Niossi is clearly a man of vision and such a fantastic development is well noteworthy and uh, needs to be remarked upon and brought to everybody's attention. As ambitious as it is, the government is putting a close eye on the project. This public-private partnership falls in line with the prescriptions of the last Cameroon Business Forum and the Cameroon Investment Forum for domestic firms to be given maximum assistance. December 2017 is a landmark date for the Kekem Cocoa Transformation Plant, which is more than 70% gone after eight months of work. We start to put in the pillar equipment, which the most part is here now. So we are with the local companies to make the erection here on site. Huh? The progress as we see now, it's good. Actually, we are, li we are lifting the heavy machines. Okay, we don't see the crane, the big crane, which is inside. So the heavy, heavy machines are lifted in. We mentioned it before, now we are lifting in the heavy machines. This is a roaster. It's about uh, 14 tons heavy. We see here the cleaning sections. We have the IR, which is also already in position, not in final position, but in position. And so we go ahead, step by step. We have good progress till now. Hopefully it goes ahead like this. The financial partners like SCB Cameroon are not left out of the game. Being the major financial partner, SCB believed in the project. When the KKM Cocoa Transformation Plant would be completed, it would be one of the most modern factories in the world with the latest technology provided for by Buller, which is one of the biggest manufacturers in the world in this domain.